My people, hello, welcome back to the channel. Tonight we're taking a look at my Zooka mods and the way I have my Zooka Easy Cart modified and configured here in 2022. I've had the Zooka Easy Cart for a few years now. It is a really solid platform that's very adaptable and you can use it and configure it in a lot of different ways. And this is the way that I have it set up right now and it is focused around basically making the Rebel Carrier. I'm carrying a Upper Park Rebel with this thing. It's a fantastic cart bag and I figured out a really effective way to attach it and set it up on this cart that I'm super happy with. So I figured I would show it off to you guys in this quick video. If you are in the market for anything from Upper Park, please consider using my code DISCGOLFNERD10 at checkout. You'll get yourself 10% off your order, and you'll help directly support me and the channel. Upper Park's been awesome to work with. I'm a member of the team, and uh, yeah, it's been great. So ever since I got the Rebel, I've been trying to figure out the best way to attach it to the cart. And the first thing I did was attach this shelf to my cart. Um, now, it's got this kind of funky-looking foam pad on it right now. There was a little bit of a proof of concept. It doesn't look quite as, as nice as I would like for sure but it was something that I was trying out and uh, I may end up getting a different piece of foam I may end up removing it definitely makes it a little bit more comfortable I'm also still using the old uh, 3d printed grip on this thing I definitely recommend those so the main thing I did is that is where the original cross bracket was there I was able to use pre-existing holes and all the hardware to basically just move that cross piece down further and uh, mount the pole there and then I was able to use uh, just a replacement of that bracket that I found online to uh, to to do that so it worked out super well now I just have two of the same uh, brackets on there one up on the pole in the middle and then one uh, holding on to that that lower shelf keeping it really stable and you can kind of see that little bit of a silver edge there that's where I cut off the posts so those are completely gone it took some weight off of the cart and also got them out of the way of the drink holders for the rebel little piece of memory foam here definitely doesn't hurt the uh, comfort of this thing because what's nice about having the shelf is if I get to a backup on a course or something I can just take the bag off real quick and I can sit down on top of this cart which is really nice uh, so, really simple in terms of the way I attached this board. It happened to be the, just about the perfect size. I had it laying around already, and uh, all I did was just kind of eyeball it. You can see how I, I made those marks on the underside. I drilled holes straight through it, zip-tied it, and then I used some heavy-duty black Gorilla Tape to uh, just cover up the whole top of the shelf as well before I even installed the foam. Here it is with the Rebel on top of it from behind here. You can see how I have it attached. All I did was I just removed the little anchor uh, point on the end of this thing so I can slip it back through that buckle, slide it down through and underneath into that, uh, that hole right there onto the cart, and then I can just thread it back through as normal and pull it tight and it stays in a perfect spot so this has worked out extremely well I've tried a number of different things uh, for this I even sewed some attachment loops onto a different rebel in a previous uh, attempt at this but this is definitely the way to go it doesn't harm the functionality of the bag at all all I have to do is just thread those through and I can pick the bag up and carry it as normal if, if I want to and I can always fold that over and sew it again if I want that anchor point back on there so it didn't damage the uh, the straps in any way here's another uh look at it and uh yeah that's basically it man and it, it really has worked out super well it carries everything i need it's a relatively compact package which is great and uh yeah it took a little bit of weight off the cart as well and yeah that's the rebel carrier let me know if you guys have any questions about this and i'll do my best to answer them in the comments down below thank you so much to all of you for your continued support to my patreon supporters my viewers my subscribers i appreciate you all we are well on our way to 15,000 subscribers and I, but i need your help to get there so if you like the content Hit that subscribe button, stay tuned for future uploads, and be part of the community that we've built here on the Disc Golf Nerd channel. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you later. Cheers.